kwa majina naitwa Priscilla David na miaka moja ninasoma katika shule ya Ilaz Montessori na nipo katika klabu ya Think Green katika klabu ya Think Green mimi ni Natura Natura ni mtu ambaye anapenda kuambia watu kuhusu mazingira na watu wanapata kuelewa kuhusu mazingira na pia leo tupo nipo na maafiki zangu tunasafisha beach kwa sababu napenda kutunza mazingira na ukitunza mazingira na yenyewe anakutunza kwa hiyo na mimi napenda kutunza mazingira ah nimekuta vitu vingi kama pempasi manguo mabegi viatu wametupa Ah, wengine hawajui kuhusu mazingira wala hawana elimu ya mazingira ila sisi tunayo elimu ya mazingira. Kwa hiyo wengine hawawezi jua ila wengine wanajua ila hawapendi kutunza mazingira. Ushauri wangu ni kwamba na washauri wenzangu, wakubwa zangu hata wadogo pia watunze mazingira. My name is Isabella. My Peter Ongoli, Siki Green, I'm coming to my South from Mazingira. I'm going to be a Pasi, Makopo, Begi, Kitenge, Nguo, Hata Vitu Vingine. I'm going to Sindano, Vitu Vya Hospitali, Tumeziona. Walibifu wa Bahari. Majina naitua Isdoli Zabron. Natokea Kigamboni. Nipo katika NGO inaitua Sustainable World Initiatives. Mekujia hapa kujumuika na ndugu jamaa wa NGO tofotofote kwa jili ya kweka gigi kibiche ya mbalamwezi safi. Mimi ni mwana mazikila huwa napenda sana kushiriki katika kutunza bali kwa sababu takataka nyingi za plastic na glassy huwa na asili sana viumba balini ambapo endapo zitakaa kwa mda mrefu bila kuoza. So kama jamii inabidi tuwe na moyo kwa kuja kujitolea kwa ajili ya kusafisha bahari kwa sababu tukitunza bahari na yeye inaweza kututunza. Sababu asilimia kama sabini ya hayo tunaopata inatokana na bahari. Ah tumekuta vitu vingi, tumekuta plastiki, tumekuta glasi, tumekuta mabegi, nguo, yaani ni vitu vingi ambavyo vinakuja bahari na alafu safi kwenye fukwa za bahari kwa sababu watumiaji ni sisi wenyewe na tunaochafua ni sisi wenyewe so ningependa kila mmoja mmoja tuwe na nanilio moyo wa kujitolea kwa ajili ya kuja kusafisha bahari kwa sababu tukitunza bahari na yeye itatutunza habari kwa majina naitwa Elakiza Richard Jackson na umri wa miaka 16 na ni mwanzilishi wa klabu ya mazingira ya Think Green Environmental Club Think Green Environmental Club inajihusisha na watoto kuanzia miaka mitano mpaka miaka 18 ni tunajaribu kuelimisha jamii yetu kuhusiana na mambo ya mazingira na utunza kwa ajili ya mabadiliko ya tabia ya nchi. Leo tumekusanyika na wenzangu pamoja na watoto na vijana katika shughuli ya usafi ya usafi wa mazingira hapa katika Sawasawa Bay. Na tunasafisha mazingira kwa sababu plastiki hizi ambazo zinaenda kusombwa na mawimbi ya maji zitaingia baharini ambazo zitapelekea samaki wale plastiki wa kila plastiki samaki watakufa na hii itapunguza chakula cha samaki. Kwa chakula cha samaki itakuwa katika kiwango cha chini. Lakini pia tuna support juhudi za serikali kwa kuhakikisha kwamba mazingira yetu yawe masafi ili tuweze kuishi katika mazingira masafi lakini pia tujiepushe na magonjwa mbalimbali ambayo yanaweza kusababishwa na mazingira. Lakini pia tunatunza mazingira yetu kwa ajili ya kesho yetu iliyo bora kwa sababu sisi ni vijana na bado tuna muda mrefu wa kuishi na tukituza mazingira yetu basi tutaepukana na janga la mabadiliko ya tabia ya nchi. Naitwa Lafasha Richard Jackson na mimi ni moja kati ya watu ambao wamekuja kusafisha bahari. Leo nikitokea klabu ya Think Green. Think Green ni klabu ya mazingira ambayo tunawawezesha watoto na vijana kujua mazingira ni nini na namna gani wanaweza kuyasaidia. Kama tunavyoona bahari ni moja kati ya kitu ambacho kinatupatia hewa safi. Na tunatakiwa tuitunze bahari inapokuwa chafu tunapotupa taka, taka baharini tunatengeneza mazingira bahari inakuwa chafu tu watu tunaathirika lakini pia samaki na vitu vingine vinaathirika naitwa Lamsey tupo hapa sawa 
sawa beach dar es salaam sisi kama global peace kwa kushirikiana na brute force security tupo hapa beach kwa ajili ya kufanya usafi wa beach tulikuwa tuna jukumu moja kubwa kama watanzania kama mashirika tukiwa tunaokota takataka zote ambazo zinachafua beach hii hapa atufanye shughuli hii katika beach peke yake tushafanya shughuli hizi katika beach karibia zote kwa hapa dar es salaam lengo letu kuu ni kusafisha mazingira tunasafisha mazingira kwa ajili ya kulinda afya ya viumbe hai ambao wako majini na afya ya viumbe hai ambao ni sisi binadamu ambao tunazitumia hizi beach kuna machupa ya plastiki ambayo hayaozi kwa ya kika hapa huwa yanaharibu mandhari ambayo inaonekana hapa lakini pia zinakuepo chupa za vyuma ambazo ni chupa za pombe ambazo kama ikitokea kipande kikapasuka huwa vinasababisha madhara makubwa katika mwili wa binadamu nachowashauri wa Tanzania wenzangu tujitahidi kutunza mazingira tusiwe wachafuzi wa mazingira kwa sababu tunavyo tuyatunze mazingira leo hii ili yatutunze sisi leo hii na kizazi chetu kijacho asante sana kwa jina naitwa Mathangambi ni mkurugenzi wa shirika la Global Peace Foundation Tanzania uh, leo tumejumuika hapa asubuhi hii uh, kwa ajili ya kuweza kusafisha ufukwe kama mnavyoona uh, na hizi ni harakati ambazo tumekuwa tunazifanya tangu taasisi hii ianzishwe 2015 tumekuwa tukiwashirikisha wadau mbalimbali NGO zingine uh, wadau wa mazingira uh, jamii kwa ujumla serikali za mitaa eneo husika kwa ajili ya kuhakikisha kwamba tunasafisha mazingira kwa sababu mazingira ni uhai mazingira ni uhai uh, bila kuwa na mazingira safi unaweza kupata magonjwa mbalimbali na matatizo mengi tu na beach tunajua ni sehemu ya kupumzika ni sehemu ambayo unakuja uh, unapoteza mawazo unafurahia unaenjoy basi ni vizuri uenjoy sehemu ambayo pia iko safi na salama kwa hiyo leo tuliunganika kwa pamoja kama unavyoona tukawa tumefika hapa tukasawa basi tuweze kufanya hii shughuli yetu ya leo Ah ya yeah, kwa kweli mimi ningetoa rai kwa Watanzania. Najua juhudi zinafanyika nyingi na kwa kweli tunaona improvements lakini bado tuendelee kuongeza juhudi hizo. Uh, unakuta kuna sehemu kabisa ya kutupia taka. Lakini unakuta kuna mtu mwingine mwananchi mwingine anatupa pembeni au anatupa barabarani. Basi turudi tuwe wastarabu kidogo. Tushike ule uchafu wetu. Tutafute sehemu ambayo tunaweza tukatupa ambayo ni salama haiwezi kuchafua mazingira. Tukumbuke kwamba mazingira ni uhai. Basi tutengeneze hii generation ambayo tupo sasa tuitengeneze iwe salama tuachie na wenzetu fikiria kizazi hiki tungekuta kila sehemu ni uchafu tungeweza kuishi jibu ni hapana kwa hiyo ni jukumu letu sote kuweka uh, dunia hii kuwa ambayo iko safi na salama kwa ajili ya vizazi vijavyo na vizazi na vizazi vyote yeah my name is Ingrid Kim i'm a journalist actually uh, as you colleague uh, from Russia i i have uh, these activities uh, before in Zanzibar and this uh, uh, organization of uh, peace foundation peace global foundation to organize Zanzibar clean up it's a very demanding because touristic island international come and there so we must see the beauty of uh, nature of the beaches so here also what you do here also what you do uh, global peace foundation yes yeah, i see it's very big contribution because children are coming uh, also uh, like from a small age where we will see good example how to keep the environment clean because we have uh, um, youth uh, elsewhere like else we can invite local kids uh, because they are willing to join this is very important ability like they are not forced like they are like here they come and enjoy the environment and also when we see result like you see clean uh, beautiful beach which is spared for many kilometers i think Tanzania one of the active uh, country for supporting youth um, uh, like activities in especially in the way of environment um, when they see it's a problem in the world plastic like everywhere is pollution i want to say uh, because i know uh, nowadays you know russia and ukraine the situation is uh, everyone is watching um, when we start to clean uh, somebody say in russia our houses when you make order in all the world so start from your house uh, this is like a your uh, even like i say home i mean this is like your home because it's near to your places where you live so when, when you are not uh, indifferent when you participate in clean uh, cleanliness to keep clean the beach you show your awareness you show your conscience so please do it yeah and uh, follow up like this uh, movement and this uh, people which is a very good and big contribution to the country thank you global peace foundation tanzania thank you very much thank you uh, this is uh, 
Mr. Prashan from uh, Mo Recycle uh, Plant. sister company for A1 products and bottlers. Uh, we have our own recycling, pet bottle recycling uh, unit at the Bagala. Now we are here to support the beach cleanup event organized by Global Peace. As part of uh, social responsibility as a uh, responsible manufacturers of uh, uh, pet bottles, we are doing recycling from last six years. Until uh, date, we recycled about uh, 40,000 metric tons of PET bottles and export them to the different countries. Okay. So we are here to support the these NGOs who's uh, doing the awareness in people. So we are always behind them to support them in such uh, events. Thank you. Hey! 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 Hey!